In terms of broader perceptions of history in India, censorship means that the Indian public and Indian students are not receiving the full story. Now, I think that this is not a particularly big concern here at AMU. You all have a superstar lineup of Mughal historians to guide you, right? So I'm not worried about you all. In fact, I'm actually sometimes linked with AMU by those seeking to criticize all of us. More broadly, though, I think it's a significant threat to scholarship that the Indian government paternalistically prioritizes myths and emotions about the past over historical analysis. Even a lightly censored Aurangzeb, however, proved too much for many. My Aurangzeb book has been out for about a year and a half in India, and it's upset many readers. Here you see some of the view negative viewpoints on my biography of India's most hated king. I want to underscore that these are all from published reviews of the book, right? An editor actually looked at all of these and agreed to publish them. 